Did you ever just have one of those days when you just can't get enough energy? Well, when these days happen, I grab a red line directly from my back side. The birds are singing, the sky turns blue, and life feels, well, a little less tight. Light! So get out there and have a very great day with Redline Extreme. You too should try Redline Extreme. Only drink half. You don't want your head to explode or your anus to bleed. Red line extreme. Good morning, everyone. Evil Jamie. Oh, this one's going out to Baghead. Baghead, Tim. Oh, my God, man. I just, oh, oh God, I messed that up. Oh, Jesus. Man, oh, coach, thank you. Man, this one's going out to Tim Water, Baghead. He does, he does our music for the show. What? Evil Dave going out baghead style. Have you ever done anything in your life where you want to put a bag over your head? Have I got a story for you guys? It is lengthy. So, uh, but before I get into that, I just want to show you what we got here today. So, Tim, we got your first commander deck, most likely. Uh, I got a bundle for Thrones of Eldraine. Chaos box. And, oh yeah, oh yeah. Going out with the fan question. Uh, feet, this is my feedback bonus uh, from NC Jam. That is a Wall of Swords Unlimited. So, and that looks uh, pretty, like, the, the packaging is not that good. So, but NC Jam, check them out. Best repacker in the game. And yes, I do have an NC Jam pack here for Baghead. Because he, like me, is old school. So, we're both old guys. And then, ooh, Kelvin Warlord. Wow. Okay, that is actually a Unlimited Rare. Wow. Okay, so this going out. With the fan question, okay, my last three packs of Dom Remastered from that box, oh yeah, Ikoria and Infinity Collector Booster, and of course, NC Jam, man, so check them out, link will be in the description for NC Jam, um, legit repacker, guys, he is, he is awesome, so, but uh, while we're waiting for the story, hey, shitbird, speed this up. He's kind of. <laughs> and we're back okay so t uh tim uh generally what i do is i give out some stuff as we go along you you know this you've watched our show many times so here's the fan stuff right here valkyrie harbinger going out with the fan question uh i generally send out the die but i'm actually going to give this one to tim because we're rolling a 13 here to be uh, the best number in uh, the world. We'll start off, actually, we'll start with the Commander of Legends. That's actually pretty good. Uh, Battle for Baldur's Gate, one of the newer ones. And here's the sample pack, Tim. That's going out to you, of course. And obviously, the Commander deck is going out to you. So uh, this, uh, I'll, I'll put this all together. So I'll tell you what, because I'm giving them, because I'm, I'm having you keep the die, I'll give them the spin down. Cool. Tim's like, that's my day. So I'm, I met Tim in Michigan, by the way. Oh, there we go. <laughs> wow, that's actually a pretty good one. Not bad. Not, not bad, man. Captain, I got the roll. So, Tim, that's your commander deck, buddy. And uh, yes, obviously, this stuff will go out with you. The, the 100 sleeves and uh, the commander box. I'll put that in there. And uh, Tim, once again, thanks, man. 
So what you do is super cool. He just he likes to add to. He likes our show and he adds to it. And he's always in the comments, comment line, and even on the rule of cools. So check us out, rule of cool on Tuesday nights. So uh, 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 there it is. Oh, sorry, what is my teeth is. So uh, uh, Tim, art card and land card always goes out with the fan question. You know this though. So slat a hand. All right. Yeah, so the time I wanted to put a bag over my head, I have to go way back when I was uh, 20 years old. Uh, ooh, there we go, man. Elevator. That's a, that's a, a nice commander card my, itself. Wow. Asinine Antics. Two, two Mythics in a row, man. Dragon Mantle. Not bad. Not bad. I, I love these uncommon cards they have here. These borderless ones. And Ashiox Reaper. Wow. Flanking Village. Whew, okay, and that's, uh, oh man, it, it, that's Commander 14. That's actually not a bad list card, dude, to get in the back. Uh, Ashiox Reaper, foil going out with a lucky fan. So, yeah, I was I was 20 years old, and my car was making a severe noise. We eventually found out what it was. There was a hole about the size of a half dollar ready to bust in the tire. How my dad and I missed it is beyond me. But... I used to come home on the weekends, Pollen Shield, and I would work uh, at a grocery store right down the street from my parents' house because I was making good money there. So I actually come home on the weekends. Imagine that, you know. So like before, I, like I was working forty hours a week for the first two years of college, and then I I got a, a little bit of money where I could actually go and stay at college, and that's what I did. My last two years, I spent it out at Westfield Westfield State College, now university. Imagine that. And uh, Utopia Sprawl, very nice foil. That is going out with a lucky fan. Sorry, Tim. Monster card in the back. And uh, anyway, we couldn't pinpoint what it was. And my car, like, it was a it was a, <laughs> a Mercury Tracer Station Wagon. Look it up. 1988 Mercury Tracer Station Wagon. And yeah, it just, it, like, it got me from point A to point B. It lasted all four years of college. I bought the car, you know, and Wow. Ariat, Charmed Apple, not bad, man. That's actually a decent card, man. And it's and it's borderless. Oh, boy. Wow, Polluted Bonds. And, not, and that's the anime one, man. Tim, score on that pack, man. Sky Beast going out. And Mercadia's Downfall. I want, that's from Mercadia's Mask. So not bad, Tim. Doing that, doing decent on those. And uh, my both my parents had a car, and they worked at the same grocery store. Signed art card going out. Beautiful foil, swamp, not bad. And uh, I'm like, oh, oh, shoot, hold on, I just dropped that card. That went underneath. God damn it. Tim, I'm sorry, buddy. Let's, uh, hold on. That's uh, that's going to be lightly played. Hold on. Listen for it. Oh, man. Ah, oh, God, did I just do that? I'm so sorry, man. And listen, guys, lightly played, lightly played. Uh, wait, let's see if we can get it. Yeah, there it is right there. <laughs> Tim, I'll sign that for you. And uh, I, I asked, I'm like, Dad, is it okay if I take Mom's car back to school, which is over 100 miles away? Oh, I have to put Evil Dave there. He likes Evil Dave. And uh, I mean, who doesn't like Evil Dave? And I said, I I'll, pay, I'll pay for it to go to the shop. This is just Tim. I'm just putting it off to the side. And, uh, you know, and I'll bring mom's car back next weekend. Like, I wasn't, like, a drinker, a partier, any, any of that stuff. Like, I didn't have the money. I didn't have the time to do any of that stuff. And he got really upset with me. And I know why he did. Ley Line of Anticipation, beautiful, beautiful card right there. Not bad. Discerning Financer and Wicked. You can, this is a pretty good bundle, man. And uh, actually, pause real quick. I got to blow my nose. And we're back. Sorry about that, guys. Allergy season. Oh no! Oh, oh, did you guys see that? I I had some snot on there. Tim, you got some of my DNA, buddy. So anyway, um, I was not a prior to this time. I was not a good person. I was a very selfish, narcissistic young man who thought uh, he was the cat's meow, so to speak. And Curiosity, what a busted card that is. Read what that does. All you good Magic players know exactly what that is. So, card in, draw engine. So anyway, it, it, um, 
And I think my and my dad had a hard time with me growing up. He, now, mind you, this is a man that only hit me twice in my life, and both times he did it, he said, this is hurting me. Not, this is going to hurt me a lot more than it's going to hurt you. He said, oh, asinine antics again, man. Not bad. Ground seal. Very nice. Ooh. Ever tits. Ever tits. <laughs> and he harkened back to some of those days where I was not a good person. And it, like, you know, he had a, he had a moment. Now at this time, like I was a decent individual. I still wasn't great. Don't, don't get me wrong. And I know you guys are like, no, Dave, you're really kind of a given person. Yeah. Things change as time was on. It's called maturity. But uh, at that time, not a good person. There's no other way to say it. Dark tutelage, great uncommon. And ooh, Dawn of Hope. Nice. Borderless. We'll take that. That might be the anime too. I can't tell. All right, guys. Uh, I'll finish up the story here in a minute. Stand by. And we're back. All right. Hey, this came out of the chaos, uh, the chaos pack. That actually is not bad. So, oh, is, this, is Dragon's Dark here see through? Let's see if we can see through it. Mm, no, we can't. Let's see. Nope, I'm not seeing through it. Some of those old packs, you can actually do that. So anyway, my dad, it, it, now mind you, I was working full time for the most part all throughout college, but my parents were springing a lot of the cost for college due to my great grandfather passing away. My dad sold that house, split it three ways and gave it to his kids, not taking a dime. Both he and my mom, not taking a dime. And don't gold dragon, original card. And um, didn't again just unselfishly gave it to his children. He says, "This is this is how much we can give you for college. The rest is on you guys." So I still had to work while going, and all I did was work out, work, and go to school and do very well. Like my even my dad was surprised, like how I turned out. So uh, <laughs> he. He, uh, he would say that to his friends, too. He's like, I didn't expect him. Wow, Seagate, Seagate Stormcaller. Not bad. Not the mythic you're looking for, but still a pretty decent card. Twiddler card going out with Mr. Twiddler. And um, he just got up and he, he like, he, he just had this no. And all I heard in my mind was, <whistles> wow, wow, wow. It was going to be a showdown between me and my dad. Now, my mom and my brother were sitting on the couch. And my dad took his finger and my, now my back was to the upstairs, you know, the steps going upstairs and he jabbed me in the sternum. Now this is a man that was almost six foot. I'm five foot six. My mom was five foot. I ended up being five foot six. Go figure. And uh, right in the middle. But he was a, uh, a meat cutter, butcher. And this guy would just toss 200 pound boxes across a walk-in cooler with ice in it like it was nothing. So this guy was, lack of a better term, cock strong, but a very gentle man at that. But he, he jabbed me three times in the sternum. And he's like, no, it's always about you. And like, this was the one time where I didn't feel like I was being selfish. And I remember grabbing his finger and I went like this. Wee! And, and, and I, you know, I, I turned him up like, turn him up like that. He's like, it, it was the one time I actually physically touched my dad in a bad way. And he, and I forgot he was left-handed. He just took his other hand and went Poof, and pushed me against the steps. Well, simultaneously, I grabbed him by the collar, pulling myself up, but, but dragging my dad face first into the steps. And I lifted myself up. I, I personally, I look back like, yeah, I meant to do that. Like, no, no, man. This was like a very, it wasn't expected by him or by me. Wow, Dragon Whisperer, Mythic from Fruit Dragon's Dark Care. Not bad, dude. No foils in the back. All right, to be continued. Stand by, guys. And we're back. We're starting for the sample pack. So I said, I don't know what your problem is. I am just trying to get my car fixed, which I said I would pay for but I need a vehicle to get back to school. Again, I don't drink, I don't do drugs, I don't gamble, I don't do any of that shit. Didn't have any girlfriends, nothing. Everything was about school and myself in that, in that time. And, like, I, and I, I was so angry at him. Oh man, barroom brawl. Yeah, service nightmare speaker. Sorry, Tim, not, not uh, the cards you were looking for. 
So, uh, no, but as, as a matter of fact, Sivers going out with a lucky fan. I haven't given a fan a card away in a while. So, I was so upset, at my, and I just said, I don't know what your effing problem is. I go, I've done nothing wrong. I Have I not freaking, uh, what was the word? Ha, have I not impressed you? Am I not doing the right things? And I was so angry. I had uh, I had this on my keychain. I had a, the old Victorinox um, Swiss Army knife, the, the, the big one, the big thick guy that had everything. I found it when I was working at Great Woods during the summertime. Absorb, very nice, very nice card. Oh, Tiana, yeah, our broke siphon mage. Okay, that going out with the forest. Sorry, Tim, I got to give a little bit of stuff away. So. Anyway, um, and I, I'm like, you know what? Fuck it. And I threw my set of keys, house keys and everything, and it punched through one side of the couch and out the other and into the wall. And then they dropped. Like, that's all. I, I had a gun. I had a cannon. But my mom was sitting on the couch, and I, I didn't hit her, obviously, but it went, you know, it went like just beneath her. I was that mad. And... Oh, Vex and Sphinx. Yeah. Momentary blink. Okay, momentary blink. Excuse me. Call of the Herd going out with Lucky Fan. That actually might be a little bit. So, I walked out of the house, got in my car. I had an extra set of keys in, in the, uh, the visor. Just pulled it down. I'm like, I am not coming home next weekend. And chain lightning. And started driving back to school. Well, 30 miles into it. The tire pops, of course, that my father and I somehow didn't recognize. And I had a call him from one of those rotary phones. There we go, Jareel. Not bad. So, and with shit. Ooh, white main lion. I actually like this in draft. That was actually pretty cool. And swamp and insect token going out in the back. All right, guys, stand by for the final, final end of the story. And we're back. So what I didn't mention is that uh, I was truly shamed. Uh, driving before the tire popped, and I was I started to cry, which I didn't do that often. I was upset because my parents, best parents in the world, bar none, and no offense to anybody else's parents out there, I just had the best upbringing, uh, moral wise, etc. Just great, great human beings, and uh, it it bothered me that. I did that because my parents always had my back and I had a momentary lapse in judgment when doing that. I should not have done that. And the couch was brand new, by the way, which my parents did not have a lot of money. <laughs> so even though they were helping us with college, none of that went to them. Oh, Galaxy Foil. There you go, man. Wait, let's see if we can freaking get it here. It's it's tough, but that trust me, that's a Galaxy Foil. I think, is it? Yeah, there it is right there. I, I, I thought I saw a Galaxy Foil there. Carnival Barker, also Galaxy Foil. Oh, man, there it is right there. So, and Showcase Galaxy Foil. Uh, let's see if we can get it right there. You can kind of see it right in there. Anyway, uh, bingo. Is that like a... Oh, I thought that was an error. It's a little bug. And yeah, it's it, it bothered me. And uh, I had to call the house back up and... Beautiful galaxy foil. And, it, you know, like I needed the, the car. So my dad actually drove down. He he picked up the phone too. I'm like, Dad, I, my tire was busted. I have the donut on there. The donut's low on air. What do you want me to do? And he goes, I'm 70 miles from, he's like, where are you? And I told him like, I'm over 70 miles from, the, from school. And he goes, I'll be down in a little bit. So amidst all that, my dad came down. Never called him the old man. And he, like, just did the right thing as a dad. And it was a, there was no, like, hugs or anything like that. But, like, immediately we went to being cordial with one another. Oh, son of creation. Oh, not the one you want to see there. Yeah, definitely not the one you want to see there. Ikoria, by the way. I love Ikoria. And... Yeah, he, he took my car back and I took his car to work to school and I brought it back the next day. Wow! That was a shitty pack until this sucker came up. Woo! I have not pulled one of these my, myself, dude. And I've opened three boxes of these. Ghidorah, King of Cosmos. 
That is the one you want to see, Tim. That is, and I, I put these in there because, you know, Tim's old. He definitely saw Godzilla back in the day. These are the Godzilla cards, Tim. Very nice. And it's all. I grab a red line directly from my backside. Also, uh, Tony from Don't Make This Weird's favorite set. Wow, uh, 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 you know, Archipelago, who cares? Wait, I oh, just want to make uh, a little uh, cringe there. Stand by. Nothing says loving like my ripped cards. That's going out to you, bud. That's the, save that one. So, uh, yeah. Um, so there, you know, there he was. We got into a fight. I, you know, I destroyed his property. And here he is coming. You know, he works six days a week, even at that time. And has always provided for me. NC Jam, best repacker in the game. And uh, by the first, by the way, the first two I'm going to rip off for uh, the fans. So greed from sixth edition, and uh, frail leases wind, and that is from Ice Age. Not bad. So anyway, yeah, he. Um, you get these, these are any time you see a common, uh, it's usually unlimited. So that's definitely unlimited. So, uh, so yeah, um, I like you guys just watch these. He did. He came down and he didn't. He, he didn't even have to. He could have let me just stay there and, and pay for a, uh, you know, a, a record to come out and whatnot. Three Wishes from Vision. Sorry, I just love that card. It's only like two or three bucks, but it's just a, such a cool freaking card. And, um, oops. Did I? Yeah, I did. I did that. So, yeah. Elvis Farmer. Sorry, I get into these. Armageddon. Wow. And that's what? Fourth edition? That's not bad. I think it's the last time they printed Armageddon, too. Got one more here in the back. Amy Weber, 1994. Ooh, Stone Calendar. That is actually a really, really good card. That is so nice, man. That's from the dark. Very, very nice, man. A little off-centered, a little tiny play here in the corner, but these are very nice. These are, these are old-school cards. So, yeah, and... Anyway, I was going back to when I was when I switched out the cars. I started to tear up again, only because I was ashamed, and I never wanted to shame my parents. But I thought back to how I actually was, and to a varying extent, how I actually still was. And I had a lot of growing up to do. And here's the man who works six days a week, fifty to sixty hours a week give me his car so we can go send mine to the shop and either walk to work or drive him with my mom. So anyway, bag Ed. Hey buddy, thank you so much uh, for, for investing in the show. You put a lot of work into it and uh, we, we don't forget those things. And this is how we pay it back, man, as, as best we freaking can. So till next time, guys, deuces, much love. Tell your parents you love them. Evil Dave going out baghead style. Thank you for watching our short video.